Hi there, I'm Kelly Fox with your weekly horoscope for December 8th through the 14th. And as the holiday season gets underway, there's a sociable uh, full moon in Gemini, which brings friends and family together for a really good time. Uh, and meanwhile, we've got Mercury's arrival in Sagittarius, which ushers in optimistic, uh, free range thinking, uh, which isn't afraid to experiment or break the rules. Love planet Venus is really busy this week too. She first forms a really nice sextile to dreamy Neptune. So that brings the rose colored glasses along with the hearts and kittens and rainbows and flowers and all things magical. But that unfortunately doesn't last too long as pretty soon we'll be hit with a dose of reality midweek. And that's when sweet Venus turns bitter. And that's thanks to a conjunction with somber Saturn. So this is a get down to business serious type of energy. And it may be hard going if you're a cardinal sign and that's Aries, Cancer, Libra or Capricorn. And if that wasn't enough, uh, Venus forms another conjunction, but this time to suspicious and manipulative Pluto. So again, this is not great news for the cardinal signs or anybody that has planets in cardinal signs. Well, at least the full moon in Gemini lightens the mood somewhat, but you know, the flip side is watch out for gossip and misdirected flirtations. Uh, we've also got communicative Mercury in Sagittarius. So that's telling us to be careful about being too arrogant or too dogmatic. And if you're an Aries, everyone wants something from you this week. So leaving you with very little time for yourself. Uh, and what time you do have, concentrate on your family, particularly any siblings you might have. Uh, it's a good time to end a feud or to get back in touch perhaps. If you're a Taurus, uh, keep your festive spending under control because the full moon is in your money zone and it's linked to an emotional attempt to buy love or friendship. So you know better than this and it's uh, important to stick to your budget and show your love in other ways. Gemini, well, the Gemini full moon means you want to be the center of attention and you're likely to get your wish. Uh, it's a fantastic time to host a holiday party or to entertain friends and family. Uh, you'll shine on a date as well if you're single. Uh, so with more than your fair share of admirers. Uh, cancer, pay special attention to your dreams as they bring messages from the cosmos and from your own subconscious. You are a water sign and you are highly intuitive. So if you struggle to decode them, uh, talk to a like-minded friend who may have insight into what you're experiencing and trust your own instincts. Leo, uh, friends lift you up this week and keep you flying high. Even if work-related stress threatens to bring you down again, uh, it's time to cherish those who have su supported you this year and to show your gratitude toward them. You know, your sign is uh, the one of generosity after all. Virgo, don't be surprised if you find your career goals changing right before your very eyes. Uh, while everyone winds down for the holidays, the full moon encourages you onwards and upwards. Uh, and it's a good time to get yourself noticed, especially as December unfolds. There's a lot of unexpected energy coming for the earth signs like yours. Libra, a sense of rest restlessness uh, can be stemmed by making some adventurous plans for next year. Book a vacation with a difference or research the trip of a lifetime. Uh, even if you can't afford it yet, you can still dream and dreams can manifest into reality. So just remember that one. Scorpio, uh, the full moon brings sudden insight into an emotional issue uh, which has been holding you back. So being able to release, uh, being able to release that 
feels like a breakthrough, setting you up for a positive year ahead and for a whole host of new possibilities. Again, you're a water sign, you're a strong manifester, trust your instincts and your intuition. Sagittarius, there's a full moon in your love zone, which means it's time to compromise with your sweetheart. So stop expecting to get things all your own way and instead uh, start to truly listen to your lover's concerns and worries. Teamwork will win the day for sure. Capricorn, uh, who says you have to wait until New Year to make your resolution? The time is now and your willpower is strong during this full moon. So kick a bad habit um, and think about your health uh, in a holistic sense uh, with a focus on your overall well-being. It's now time to make changes. Aquarius, if you're single, the full moon could bring a drama to the dating scene, perhaps with some intense encounters and some spontaneous decisions. Um, it's a lot of fun, but not necessarily the stuff from which dreams are made. Uh, so keep your feet on the ground. Uh, and Pisces, get out and about into nature as much as you can. Uh, this full moon in your home zone encourages you to get away from your own four walls uh, for better insight into where you're headed next year and beyond. So ground yourself and distance yourself from any drama this week. 